CoffeeScript is a programming language that transcompiles to JavaScript. It adds syntactic sugar inspired by Ruby, Python and Haskell to enhance JavaScript's brevity and readability. Specific additional features include list comprehension and pattern matching. The language has a relatively large following in the Ruby community. CoffeeScript support is included in Ruby on Rails version 3.1. In 2011, Brendan Eich referenced CoffeeScript as an influence on his thoughts about the future of JavaScript. History On December 13, 2009, Jeremy Ashkinas made the first Git commit of CoffeeScript with the comment, Initial commit of the mystery language. The compiler was written in Ruby. On December 24, he made the first tagged and documented release, 0.1.0. On February 21, 2010, he committed version 0.5, which replaced the Ruby compiler with a self-hosting version in pure coffee script. By that time the project had attracted several other contributors on GitHub, and was receiving over 300 page hits per day. On December 24, 2010, Ash Keeners announced the release of Stable 1.0.0 to Hacker News, the site where the project was announced for the first time. Syntax Almost everything is an expression in CoffeeScript, for example if, switch and for expressions return a value. As in Perl, these control statements also have postfix versions. For example, if can also be written after the conditional statement. Many unnecessary parentheses and braces can be omitted. For example, blocks of code can be denoted by indentation instead of braces, function calls are implicit, and object literals are often detected automatically. Examples, interval test, to compute the body mass index, one may do. With CoffeeScript the interval is directly described. Loops and comprehensions, to compute the greatest common divisor of two integer numbers with the Euclidean algorithm, one usually needs a while loop whereas in CoffeeScript one can use until and pattern matching instead. Any for loop can be replaced by a list comprehension. So that to compute the squares of the positive odd numbers smaller than 10, one can do. Alternatively, there is functions and jQuery, a common JavaScript snippet using the jQuery library is. Or even just. In CoffeeScript, the function keyword is replaced by the symbol and indentation is used instead of curly braces, as in other offside rule languages such as Python and Haskell. Also, parentheses can usually be omitted. Thus, the CoffeeScript equivalent of the snippet above is or just string interpolation, Ruby-style string interpolation is included in CoffeeScript. Double-quoted strings allow for interpolated values, using and single-quoted strings are literal dynamic variables in a class, it might not appear to be useful at first glance, but there are times where using this technique is useful. It allows you to create variables in a class, with dynamic names. Compiling, the CoffeeScript compiler has been written in CoffeeScript since version 0.5 and is available as a Node.js utility. However, the core compiler does not rely on Node.js and can be run in any JavaScript environment. One alternative to the Node.js utility is the Coffee Maven plugin, a plugin for the popular Apache Maven build system. The plugin uses the Rhino JavaScript engine written in Java. The official site at coffeescript.org has a Try CoffeeScript button in the menu bar. Clicking it opens a modal window in which users can enter CoffeeScript, see the JavaScript output, and run it directly in the browser. The JS2 Coffee site provides bidirectional translation. Issues CoffeeScript is very sensitive to white space, counting a tab as a single space. The compiler provides very rudimentary diagnostic information in the case of errors. Priority rules are not always intuitive, sometimes causing sub expressions to end up in unexpected places. Debugging is a major problem because the compiled code is not always readable. Claim of increased source code readability can be disputed. The above issues are only indicative and there are many other strong arguments for and against CoffeeScript. Latest editions, source maps offer a way to identify the corresponding JavaScript code while debugging CoffeeScript code.
Coffee Script supports literate programming where one could use light coffee file extensions to write readable programs. Adoption On September 13, 2012, Dropbox announced that their browser side code base has been rewritten from JavaScript to Coffee Script. GitHub's internal style guide for their own code says to write new JS in Coffee Script. See also Amber Small Talk, Hex, Dart, Opa, TypeScript, an open source, strict superset of JavaScript language from Microsoft. Repite Script, 1, a translator with a more Pythonic syntax, LibScript, Gorilla Script, 2, which offers additional type checking and syntactic sugar for common JS patterns such as inline callbacks, references. Further reading, Lee, Patrick. Coffee Script in Action. Manning Publications. PA 432. ISBN A 978-1617290626. Grosenbach, Jeffrey. Meet Coffee Script. Peep Coder, Bates, Mark. Programming and Coffee Script. Addison Wesley. PA 350. ISBN A 0-321-82010-X, McCaw, Alex. The Little Book on Coffee Script. O'Reilly Media. PA 62. ISBN A 978-1449321055, Burnham, Trevor. Coffee Script, Accelerated JavaScript Development. Pragmatic Bookshelf. PA 138. ISBN A 978-1934356784. External links. Official website. Coffee Script repository at GitHub. Coffee Script syntax definition to highlight your Coffee Script code in Crucible of Atlassian by Thomas Corral.